Welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Major League Baseball on tap. The Atlanta Braves going up against the Colorado Rockies. First pitch coming your way next. Just about set. Today's starting pitcher, Antonio Senzatella. He's had his ups and downs in his career as his ERA is just over four, but this is a guy that's not afraid. He's going to take the ball. He's going to go out there and give it his best. One down. So now to the plate for Atlanta, Darius Henry. Hard hit, base hit. Ozzie flying around third. He will score on the board first. It's one zip. And that keeps his hitting streak going. He's making this look way easier than it is, Boog. Setting the record is hard at all, but to keep up in it every day like he is, I don't really know what to say anymore. At this point, it honestly feels like it's never going to end. Absolutely remarkable. Here's Austin Riley. So RBI spot, but Chris, this is a guy that is not really swinging the bat all that well here. In this situation, you have a real good opportunity to get swings and misses and record a strike. Line drive, come on! Nice swing and good, solid contact. Up all the smoke, but needed a little more lift to get into the outfield gap. Maybe a little more backspin. First and third, two away. And next for Atlanta, Matt Olson. Corners are occupied with two down. Strike two. It's great to get on the board in the first frame of the ball game, but here's an opportunity for them to really open things up with a couple of runners on. Let's see if they can cash in. And yeah, there's ball four. Two walks in the first has to be some cause for concern. I mean, you're talking about a guy you want to pitch deep into the ball game. It's not going to help with the pitch count right there. They can't afford to hand out free bases at this rate. Swing and a miss struck him out. Sometimes he wears the emotion on the sleeve, but that's okay as long as he's getting results. And right there, thrilled with the punch out to get out of it. Now the Atlanta cleanup hitter, Darius Henry. Single that drove in a run his first time through. Now look out here. He's going to come up ready to swing in this situation. That one's in there, 0-1. On one. Tough situation right here. So important as a pitcher to get ahead in the count as he did right there. 0-1 oh, now. Swing, and this one's crushed. No doubt about it. Grand slam. His latest homer in an incredible season. A four spot on the board. It's five zip. Let's break out the stat cast numbers. It's singing. It tells us this home run was projected at more than 450 feet. Yeah, and not many players can hit home runs as far as this one. That's a special feeling, and I'm sure he was giggling a little bit as he was jogging around the bases. Here's Michael Tolia. It's interesting. He plays kind of a, a power spot defensively, but runs pretty well. So. When you're looking at that position, you're not expecting someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. That one felt good. It's his sixth home run of the...
Back here at the ballpark, bottom of the inning. Now it's the right fielder, Hunter Goodman. Free back to work. In the air, left side. Henry has a beat on it. Makes the catch. And there's one down. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. Now that back front back. shoulder Shut coming open off. instead of staying close. Ryan McMahon steps to the plate. He was a strikeout victim his first time. Max Freed, quite simply, has turned into one of the best left-handers in the National League, if not all of baseball, Chris. Yeah, tremendous pitcher, but he fields his position. Can't glove it cleanly. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. Now at the play, Darius Henry. He's already homered in this game. Well, in their win last game, this guy came up with two home runs, obviously trying to keep the roll going here in this one. And that one finds its way through. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells me that he is seeing it like a beach ball. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. And two away now. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound the pitch before. Felt like he should have had him looking, I think. But, you know, that's good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch to get him to swing and miss. And now it's Matt Olson's turn to hit. He's 0 for 1. And the 0-2. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Left field pretty well struck. To the warning track. Makes the catch. So two runs on three hits, including the home run. No errors, and one man left. To the bottom of inning number four now. It's the Braves eight and the Rockies five. Here's some real power at the plate. Darius Henry. He's already homered here in this one. That one is absolutely belted. Into the bleachers and gone. A solo shot. His second home run of the game. It's 9-5. Now he's just showing off out there. And who can blame him with a swing like that? Give that man a bat. Watch it go a long way. Chris, that ball came out hot. So let's see what StatCast has to say. Yeah, it really did, Boog. 111 miles per hour off the bat and a really nice launch angle as well. Just a beautiful swing from start to finish. Now the left fielder, Darius Henry. Coming off an absolute bomb in his last at bat. Henry. And that's in there for strike one. Some guys are just more confident if they can track that first pitch out of the hand of the pitcher. They don't care if they fall behind 0-1. Righty to the plate. Swings and crushes one. Right field, way back, and gone. He flexes his power with that swing. That's his third home run of the game. It's 11-5. And with the six-run lead, there are fans that are starting to head to the exits. He's putting on quite the show at the dish here in this one, and he's just so locked in with this swing, and he's just not missing right now. Three-homer game, man, it's so special. And I tell you what, it's a lot of fun watching him pull it off as well. 
So the batting order turns over. Here's the Rockies leadoff hitter, Logan Davidson. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. And the righty deals. Line drive. Can't get there, and now maybe extra bases. Safely into second. He's got a double. All over that one right there. Loud contact leads to the double. I mean, you could tell it had extra bases written all over it as it jumped off of his stick. After four wins in a row, you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll, and that's the momentum that just takes on a life of its own. Guys start hitting up and down the lineup. You never know who's going to come up with the big hit, who's going to come out of the bullpen and get the big outs, but it's a good feeling, and you want to extend it. 14-5 is your final. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby saying so long. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please... Thank you.